Mosaic Monday. Um, years ago, I was really, about three years ago, I was really good at keeping up with my blog uh, on rpaw.com's website, but um, I have fallen off of that. So I think I want to start posting every Monday about mosaics here on YouTube and um, also link it back to the blog uh, through the artpaw.com um, dog blog. So anyway, so today I'm going to show you what I've been working on. I came up with an idea uh, for the rest of the skull. So what I'm doing is I am using souvenir plates as, I had like three or four of these souvenir plates um, that have been in my mosaic stash since I started doing mosaics like in 2007. And they've just been sitting around waiting for this skull to arrive. Uh, as you can see, I got the eyes finished yesterday and now I've moved on to the back of the skull. And um, I really kind of like it. It's kind of like a crazy quilt or something. i um, going to walk all around it. You can see all the clutter on the table. <laughs> so, but it's coming along. And I like doing these souvenir plates because there's like, it's always something to look at. There's like a little bird. There's a, over here on this side, there's a woman in a bikini which I'm kind of fond of. Where did she go? Oh, she's right there. How cool is that? I love that. So yeah, it's a little, uh, I have never done much Picasso yet or working with the broken dishes. Uh, and so it's a learning experience for me, for sure. One thing I really like about the design work here is I like the color palette. Mixing, I'm mixing in some small tea, uh, there's some smalty there and some vitreous tile and greens and blues. Uh, and then I love these halfback marbles uh, cut in half. That's just like this, this guy here. You just cut it on the, you know, cut it in half and then you put it on its side. And so I like having those kind of running through it here and there because it's like, it's a cool texture for one thing. But then the other thing is the repetition of that, you know, of that element gives the piece um, some pattern and consistency because it's all, it's also mishmash with the plates um, that having those repeating lines here and there, I think it's going to help it have some cohesion. I hope so anyway. We'll see what happens. Um, I'm mixing in mirror. Um, anyway, I think it's looking pretty good. Um, using tons of thin set. Um, this is the first time I've really worked with really thin elements like mirror and then really thick elements like china. And so there's a lot of building up the back of the tile as you put it down when it's a thinner piece so that it will lay somewhat on the same level as the rest of it. So anyway. That's all I know. It's Mosaic Monday. Um, Dan's been busy carving um, a big board that we're going to carve together. He's doing most of it right now so far because I've been stuck on this mosaic. We're going to do this great big B for um, an upcoming printmaking event here in Dallas. And I will talk to you more about that guy on another day. Maybe I'll get him to tell you about it. So anyway, that's all I know. You guys have a good rest of the evening. I'll talk to you tomorrow.